feeling financially stuck? There's a way out. Are you tired of living paycheck to paycheck? Do you dream of having financial peace of mind? Many people struggle with managing their money. It's easy to feel overwhelmed and lost, but don't worry. There's a simple yet powerful solution. The 70-20-10 budget rule. This rule can transform your finances and help you achieve your money goals. It's a straightforward approach that's easy to understand and implement. Whether you're just starting or looking to gain better control of your money, the 70-20-10 rule can be your roadmap to financial success. Imagine finally being able to save for a down payment on your dream home. Picture yourself traveling the world without financial worries. With the 70-20-10 budget rule, these dreams can become a reality. In the following sections, we'll dive deep into the 70-20-10 budget rule and show you how to use it to transform your finances. Get ready to take control of your money and start living a richer life. The 70-20-10 budget rule is a simple way to manage your money effectively. It's all about dividing your after-tax income into three categories, needs, savings, and debt repayment, or charity. Firstly, 70% of your income goes towards your essential needs. This includes things like rent or mortgage payments, groceries, utilities, transportation, and insurance. Think of these as the must-haves in your life. Secondly, 20% of your income is allocated to savings and investments. This is the fun part where you put money aside for your future goals. These goals could be anything, such as buying a house, retiring early, or traveling the world. Lastly, the remaining 10% of your income is dedicated to paying off debt or donating to charity. If you have outstanding credit card bills, student loans, or personal loans, this portion helps you become debt-free faster. And if you're passionate about giving back, you can allocate this portion to support causes you care about. You might have heard of the 50-30-20 rule. It allocates 50% to needs, 30% to wants, and 20% to savings and debt repayment. The 70-20-10 rule prioritizes 70% for needs, allowing more for savings. The 50-30-20 rule values lifestyle choices and personal enjoyment. Choose the rule that aligns with your financial goals. Now that you understand the 70-20-10 budget rule, it's time to put it into action. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to help you get started. First, calculate your after-tax income. This is the amount of money you have left after taxes are deducted from your paycheck. Next, categorize your spending. Track your spending for a month or two to get a clear picture of where your money is going. Categorize your expenses into needs, wants, and debts. Then, set spending limits. Based on your income and the 70-20-10 rule, set spending limits for each category. For example, if your after-tax income is $3,000, allocate $2,100 for needs, $600 for savings, and $300 for debt repayment. Finally, make adjustments. As you track your spending, you might find that you need to make adjustments to your budget. You might realize you can cut back on certain expenses or that you need to allocate more money to a specific category. Track your spending. Know where your money goes. Tracking your spending is crucial for successful budgeting. It helps you understand your spending habits and identify areas where you can save. Luckily, there are various methods to track your expenses effectively. One popular option is using budgeting apps. These apps connect to your bank accounts and credit cards, automatically categorizing your transactions. They provide a visual representation of your spending, making it easier to track your progress. If you prefer a more hands-on approach, consider using a spreadsheet or a budgeting notebook. Create separate columns for your income, expenses, and savings goals. Note down every transaction, no matter how small, to get an accurate picture of your spending patterns. Another helpful tip is to review your bank statements and credit card bills regularly. This will help you identify any unnecessary expenses or areas where you might be overspending. By being mindful of your spending habits, you can make informed decisions about your finances. Needs versus wants spend wisely, save more. Distinguishing between needs and wants is essential for effective budgeting. While this might seem straightforward, it can be tricky in practice. Here are some tips to help you differentiate between the two needs. These are your essential expenses that are crucial for your survival and well-being. They include housing, groceries, utilities, transportation, healthcare, and insurance. Wants. These are expenses that enhance your quality of life but are not essential for survival. They include dining out, entertainment, hobbies, travel, and luxury items. When creating your budget, prioritize your needs over your wants. This doesn't mean you can't enjoy any of your wants. 
Instead, it encourages you to make conscious spending choices and find ways to save on your wants without sacrificing your needs. For example, consider cooking at home more often instead of dining out, exploring free or low-cost entertainment options, or opting for generic brands instead of premium ones. Automate your savings. Watch your money grow effortlessly. Saving money can feel like a chore, but it doesn't have to be. Automating your savings is a powerful strategy that takes the effort out of saving. It ensures that you consistently save money without having to think about it. Set up automatic transfers from your checking account to your savings account each month. This way, as soon as you get paid, a predetermined amount will be transferred to your savings, making it easier to reach your financial goals faster. Another option is to take advantage of your employer's retirement savings plan, such as a 401k or 403b. These plans allow you to contribute pre-tax dollars, which can reduce your taxable income and potentially lower your tax bill. By automating your savings, you'll be surprised at how quickly your money can grow over time. It's a simple yet effective way to build a solid financial foundation for your future. The Power of 20% Build a Solid Financial Foundation Allocating 20% of your income to savings and investments is crucial for building long-term financial security. This portion of your budget allows you to work towards your financial goals, such as buying a house, retiring early, or starting your own business. When it comes to saving, consider a high-yield savings account or a money market account. These accounts typically offer higher interest rates than traditional savings accounts, helping your money grow faster. For investments, explore options like index funds, mutual funds, or exchange-traded funds, also known as ETFs. These investment vehicles allow you to diversify your portfolio and potentially earn higher returns over the long term. Remember, investing involves risks, and it's essential to do your research and seek advice from a qualified financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Tackle debt head-on. Achieve financial freedom. Debt can be a major obstacle to financial well-being. The 70-20-10 budget rule allocates 10% of your income to debt repayment, helping you become debt-free faster. If you have multiple debts, prioritize them based on interest rates. Focus on paying down high-interest debts first, such as credit cards, while making minimum payments on lower-interest debts such as student loans. Consider strategies like the debt snowball or debt avalanche method to accelerate your debt repayment journey. The debt snowball method involves paying off the smallest debt first, regardless of interest rates, while making minimum payments on all other debts. Once the smallest debt is repaid, you roll the amount you were paying towards it onto the next smallest debt, creating a snowball effect. The debt avalanche method focuses on tackling the debt with the highest interest rate first. This approach saves you money on interest payments in the long run. Choose the method that aligns with your financial situation and motivates you to stay on track. Benefits of the 70-20-10 budget Implementing this budget rule brings numerous benefits. It instills financial discipline. You become mindful of spending and make conscious decisions. This helps avoid impulse purchases and overspending. It promotes consistent saving. Prioritize your financial future and reduce stress. The rule is simple and easy to understand. Lastly, it provides flexibility for individual needs. Take control of your finances today. Managing your finances doesn't have to be overwhelming. The 70-20-10 budget rule offers a simple yet effective framework to take control of your money and achieve your financial goals. By allocating your income to needs, savings, and debt repayment, you can create a solid financial foundation for a brighter future. Remember, budgeting is a personal journey and it might require adjustments along the way. Don't be afraid to experiment with different strategies and find what works best for you. The key is to be consistent, disciplined, and committed to your financial well-being. Start implementing the 70-20-10 budget rule today and experience the transformative power of financial freedom. What are your financial goals and how can the 70-20-10 rule help you achieve them? Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below.